So my name is Laura Hagen and I work at Dargaville Hospital as an occupational therapist. So my role in, at Dargaville is I spend part of my time on the acute medical ward, seeing patients and mainly preparing them for safe discharge. Um, another part of my time is spent out in the community on a referral basis, seeing people um, working towards their goals and setting them up at home. My other job is um, running an outpatient lymphedema clinic. As an occupational therapist, um, I work with people in their homes or on the hospital ward. Um, my main focus is working towards their goals. So we have a chat, figure out what's important to that person and try and help them achieve that goal. Um, I think it's really important to be person focused. It's all well and good telling someone what they should be doing and how they should be doing it, but what we should be central to is what's important to that person. I guess I look at respect as treating the person as I would expect someone of, in my family to be treated. So I make sure that I'm concerned with how they feel when I'm doing my treatment and working alongside them and things like that. Communication is really important because if someone doesn't understand why you're doing what you're doing, they're not going to work with you, they're not going to want to take part in your intervention. Caring for me is making sure that someone feels safe and comfortable with what we're doing. So I try and be really compassionate and make sure that people can keep their dignity. In hospital that's a time where you can feel quite undignified and stripped of yourself. So if you can make someone feel cared for and safe in that environment, that's really important. We're really encouraged to keep learning, keep striving to do our best. Um, we have a really great program of rural development lectures that come monthly, I think. So we can always take part in those and there's always opportunities. Um, while I've been here, I've been put through um, achieving different accreditations for housing, wheelchairs and seating. I've looked at different um, dementia courses and we're just really encouraged. Reducing the risk of harm is a really important focus for the DHB. So if I know that I've done my job right, I know that someone's at home, they're safe, they're independent and we've reduced that risk of them falling and having another admission to hospital.